Did you know when you delete files and folders from your computer, you really don't remove them from your computer? No. Instead, they get dumped temporarily into a recycle bin. What's that? Well, the recycle bin is a place on your computer where your deleted files, folders, and programs go after you delete them. Now, where is the recycle bin located? Well, first, you can typically find it on your desktop. It looks like this. You can then double click on it and it'll open up to show you all the contents inside the recycle bin that you once deleted from your computer. The nice thing about the recycle bin is that you can restore files and folders you deleted if they're still located in the recycle bin. That means if you deleted a file by accident, you can typically go to the recycle bin, find the file, highlight the file, right click and select restore and that file or folder will be restored to its original location where you originally deleted it. This is a safe measure in the event you accidentally delete a file, oops, by accident that you didn't really want to delete. Now, what's so bad about all these files piling up inside your recycle bin? Well, if you don't empty your recycle bin every now and then, you know, say like once a month or so, all these deleted files, folders, and old programs will begin to accumulate. And pretty soon, all these deleted contents inside your recycle bin will start to take up space on your hard drive. Wow, not good. Just look at this. This recycle bin has over 800 megabytes of unwanted deleted files that are sitting here wasting space on this computer. This wasted space used up by the recycle bin could be used to store new documents, files, folders, and programs. So, what do you do? Well, every month or so, you should empty out your recycle bin. Here's how. With your recycle bin open, click on File, Empty Recycle Bin. That's it. Do note, once you empty your recycle bin, all the files in there will be gone forever. There's no restoring them after they've been deleted from within the recycle bin. Another way to empty your recycle bin is to right click on the recycle bin icon from the desktop and select Empty Recycle Bin. Yep, again, it's that easy. Now, another way to empty your recycle bin is to access it through Windows Explorer. Just click on the recycle bin always located near the bottom of the list of drives and main folders. Once you do, right click on this area where the files and folders are and select Empty Recycle Bin. Again, it's really easy. And when you do, you clear up room on your computer for needed storage space for more files, folders, documents, images, and programs. A good thing. Always remember, once you empty your recycle bin, keep in mind there's no turning back. Once these files are gone, they're gone forever. And that's it. That concludes this video tutorial on how to locate, restore, and empty files located inside your computer's recycle bin. Hey, you're doing great.